We're live from Qualcomm Stadium in beautiful San Diego, California. We could see this rain all day, so the running game will be a key as the St. Louis Rams come into town to face the Green Bay Packers. Hi everyone, I'm Al Michaels, here for more great NFL action with my partner John Madden. And hold on, because this is going to be a good one. You talk about a quarterback who can lead his team to victory, this guy has all the tools you look for. Great arm, pocket presence, and the ability to hit a receiver anywhere on the field. There's not too many like this guy, and we can see him put up big numbers in this one. The Rams defense is counting on some big plays from its secondary as they attempt to short circuit this potent passing offense. And it'll be up to the defensive line to get some pressure on the quarterback and force him to throw a few ill-advised passes that'll end up in the defense's hands. This is what you hate to see as a visitor coming in here. A team that's focused and really ready to play. And let's go to the field for the coin toss. Both teams have taken the field, and let's see what happens now as we're ready for the kickoff. Wilkins is back and ready to put this one in the air. He gets the kick away. Number 29 will try to bring this one back. The Packers will start the drive from the 26. It's first and 10. Green, the lone back. Far gives the ball off. He'll take this one to the outside. And he stops at the 27. They get a couple on that play. Right now, they need to keep going at the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they'll be able to break one for a big game. Nine yards to go. Ball on their own 27. Set. Using motion. Quick drop. Steps up. Throws it. It's batted away. He was under intense pressure. And that's a right decision in that case. Get rid of the ball and take the incomplete. Well, listen, anything new from the sideline? Good news, Al. The trainer said he did sustain an injury, but it doesn't appear to be anything serious. His return is probable. Thanks, Melissa. That's very good news. Throws it out over to the left. He led him a bit too far. Oh, maybe he got held up in the line because their timing was really off on that pass. Right. It's fourth down, nine yards to go. Ball on their own 27. Number nine lines up in the backfield for the punt. Wilkins is back to receive this kick. Wilkins will be looking for some good blocking on the run back. He had an outstanding return. Anytime you can get a punt return like that, it can do a lot for your team. The most important thing is it gets your team closer to scoring. Within scoring distance. Number 84, in motion. Ball on the count. Looking to turn it upfield. And it looks like this one will be spotted at the 33-yard line. He will stop before he can go anywhere. Yeah, because those big old defensive linemen push those big old offensive linemen backwards. It's second down and 10 to go. Warner under center. Johnson gets right in there and brings him down. Right up the middle. Not much there. The defense just ate that guy up. They were right there for the stop when he tried to break through the line. Right, so they dug themselves into a hole here with no third down situation. He's looking to pass. Warner throws. And it looks like they'll mark it at the 23. He stops short. Now that's something you just can't have happen. When you run a play that's not designed, 
to take it past the first down marker. You should have just punted it away on third down. Hey. Wilkins will try to come through with the field goal here. And it's on its way. And that kick is right on target. So the drive concludes with a field goal, and they seem to be relatively happy with that. Not every drive is going to get you a touchdown. So getting three was big. Now they got to go over what worked and what didn't. So the next drive, we'll get them a TD. He sends it off. Number 32 feels it cleanly. The defense shut down the offense the last time they had the ball. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 29. Far gets set. Crosses it right. And the catch is made. The quarterback showed you his great arm on that pass. This guy can really move. He turns things up two or three notches when it really counts. That's the kind of thing you love to see as a coach. Guys who have that second and third gear. So they have first and ten here. Set. Dropping back. Gets the pass off. He had a shot but couldn't come up with it. He got his hands on it but the pass was incomplete. Sometimes you see the receivers drop the easiest passes. They must be thinking touchdown before making the catch. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 46-yard line. Only one man back. He hands it off. Herring stops him for negative yardage. He ran out of real estate there. Yeah, you talk about patience and not over-pursuing. That's what you see there. The defense did not let that play develop. He'll be faced with a long third down play here. Ball on the 48-yard line. Far sets up. Man in motion. Looking to throw. Dumps the pass off. Green just couldn't find a way to come up with that one. Number nine is looking for a good punt here. Wilkins is back to receive this kick. Wilkins signals for the fair catch. Wilkins had no room for return and calls for the fair catch. That was a smart thing to do with the coverage team closing in for a big hit. It's first and ten. And it looks like they'll mark it at the 18-yard line. So that's a gain of about five. Five yards to go. Ball on their own 18. Warner with three wide receivers. Dropping back. Tossing it to the middle. And they're able to connect on that one. Pickup of about seven. For a gain of seven yards for a first down. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 26. 
Nickelback in this time. Looking downfield. He's looking, stepping up, throwing left. And it's complete. The quarterback showed you his great arm on that pass. Not only does this guy have a strong arm, but his quick release makes him very tough to sack. First and ten. So we've reached the end of the first quarter. We've got a close one underway with the St. Louis Rams ahead of the Green Bay Packers. 3-0. The teams have switched sides and we'll start the second quarter. First and 10. Ball on their own 40. Man in motion. Gets the ball, looking for an opening. Not much on that play. Yeah, you talk about a defensive line winning the battle, and this is what you mean. The running back gets to the line, and there's nowhere to go after that. Nine yards to go. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Looking to throw. Gets the pass off. Hits his man with the pass. choice but to get rid of the ball. Down inside the 15. They'll go from the I formation. Stepping up, throwing, and this pass is completed. And it looks like this one will be spotted at the six yard line. Gain of seven. About two to go. Dropping back. Warner goes to the middle of the field. He threw a great pass, and they get into the end zone. The quarterback knew that he had to make that pass perfect, and he got the job done on that one. on the extra point. And the coaching staff is happy after that drive. Touchdowns against this defense aren't easy to come by. Hey, as an offensive coach in this league, you're always making adjustments. And hopefully you can get the defense on its heels and get it in there for the touchdown. Good job by these guys. Wilkins is back and ready to put this one in the air. He kicks it off. Deep to the sea. Number 29 is looking for a nice return. Green Bay needs two scores to get back into this one. First and 10. Ball on their own 27. Looking to throw. 
far. Passes to his right. And he lets it slip out of his grasp. He couldn't hang on. For some players, they say the worst place to hit him is right in the hand. Looks like this may be one of those guys. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 27. The Packers are in the offset eye formation. Duncan makes the tackle at the 26. Green went nowhere, John. Went nowhere fast. And they'll face a long third down here. Ball on their own 26. With an extra DB, the defense is in the nickel. Looking for a receiver. Throws it. And it's complete. The 30, the 20, the 10. Touchdown. Just an incredible pass by the quarterback. You almost put that ball right through his receiver. And with that score, the momentum has shifted. Kick is up, and the extra point is good. So that drive took only a few ticks off the clock, yet still got them into the end zone. That offense knows they don't all come that easy. But hey, when you get one, you take it. Longwell is back and ready to put this one in the air. He sends this one toward the end zone. Trying to give them good field position. Let's see if they can have the same sort of success on this position that they had on their last, picking up a lot of yardage through the air on their way to a score. So they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 21. Man in motion. He's looking to pass. Warner sends the pass away. And it's complete. And he stops at the 36-yard line. The quarterback did a real good job finding his target with that pass. That was quite a throw. This guy's been blessed with a golden arm. First and ten. Four-man front this time. Looking for room. Loses one tackle. Williams stopped him for his third tackle so far. He really covered some good ground there. And here's a guy with great speed who can pick up the first and keep the ball moving downfield. Two minutes left. He goes to the left side, and it looks like this one will be spotted at the 43. The defense can't afford to take too many gambles by going for a pick when they should just try and knock it down. One mistake can lead to a big play for the offense. to throw. Warner passes it right. He had a shot, but couldn't come up with it. And he's only able to hang on to that one. And there's really no excuse for that. You just have to catch those balls. There's no need for the quarterback to force any throw. There's a whole second half to play, and they don't want to be making any mistakes. Third and long. Ball on their own 43. the pass looking downfield passing right and it's caught Bruce didn't get enough for the first that kind of thing always makes me shake my head what was the guy thinking 
A short pass reception like that will never get you the yardage you need to move past the first down marker. Time for a punt here as it's now fourth down. To try to make their offense start from inside their own five. He's waving for the fair catch. Penalty marker down. He takes a knee. Holding number 51. Receiving team. That's a 10-yard penalty. We'll have to wait to see if they decide to try to extend their lead before halftime. If they're content with the score the way it is, they'll just try to run out the clock. First and 10. Ball at their own 10. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Loses the defender. That run didn't get them much. Yeah, there was a defender in every gap ready to make the tackle on that play. And we should see something on the ground here on second down as they look to run out the clock. Deep in their own territory. Far sets up. With the carry. Young with the tackle at the 14. That's the end That's of the, the end second of the quarter time. with the score. score. St. Louis, 10. Green Bay, 7. So with halftime now over, let's take a look at how both teams performed in the first half. Long well. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He gets the kick away. The returner will head upfield. This one is still anyone's game. First and ten. Ball on their own twenty-one. Warner sets up. Ball looking upfield. Good pursuit by the defense on that play. Yeah, the defense has some quick linebackers alignment. They seem to always move off their blocks well and in a position to make the tackle. face a long third down here. Ball on their own 20. Back to pass. Passing to his right. Bruce was the intended target on that pass attempt. Great play by getting a hand in there. You know, the quarterback needs to put that ball in a position where the defender can't get to it. That didn't happen there. Berger is looking for a good punt here. Number 82 will bring this one upfield. Still on his feet. He picks up a few yards on the return. Stop the coverage team had him wrapped up before he could do anything with it. Green, the deep man. Quick drop with the throw. The defense has it. Dexter McLean did a good job leaving the quarterback on that one. Yeah, the ball got whacked around and fell right into his hand. Right. 
So they have first and ten here. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Fall gets the toss. On the run. Wayne brought him down for his third tackle. They're going to keep testing this rushing defense. The guy seems to get stronger every time he touches a ball. Ball at midfield. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Looking upfield, looking for an open. Wayne with the tackle at the 39. He did a great job moving the ball on the ground there, John. This guy has great speed. It allows him to outrun the defenders if he can get around the corner. First and ten. Four. The deep back. He's going to throw. Surveying the field. Warner going left with a short pass. Wayne makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Right. They're just about in field goal range. Looking to pass. He's looking with the throw. Knocked down. Heads up play there to knock it down. He tried to guide it in there, but it didn't work. Third and long. Ball on the 44 yard line. going to throw. With the throw, Bruce couldn't make the catch. They tried throwing for the first, but the pass was dropped. Yeah, if you drop those third down passes, you're going to have a lonely flight home. Right. Berger will come into this game to punt. Number 82 will be looking to give his team good field position here. The last time the offense had the ball, they gave it away on an interception. Let's see what happens this time down the field. Right. Let's check in quickly with Melissa. I was able to talk to the team doctor, Al, and he indicated that it's a minor injury. They expect that it'll take a series or two off then return to the field. Thanks, Melissa. That's very good news. Green looking for a seam. That time, the offense ran it. It's important to pound the defense with a run. Sooner or later, they're going to bend. Right. They need six. Nickelback in this time. Looking for blocker. Loose ball. The Rams grab the live ball. The defense came up with the ball on that one. That ball is just as much a target as the ball carrier. You have to remember that when you get tackled. So they have first and ten here. Ball on the 29-yard line. Using motion. Over there, over there. Cut, cut. Switch, switch. He tucks it away. He's looking upfield. That run won't move them far. The lineman just failed to open up any holes to run through or give him room to work with. Second and eight. With an extra DB, the defense is in the nickel. Warner sends a man in motion. And he's brought down at the 27. Fall was dropped behind the line. Yeah, and if you want to talk about the most effective way to stop the run, it's playing on the other side of the ball. When you get penetration like that, it's very hard for the offense to get positive yardage. 
this time. Dropping back, throws over to his right. Number 42 was the intended target. Warner looked a little uncomfortable in the pocket there. It was an easy pass. How in the heck did he miss it? Wilkins and the kicking teams come on for this field goal attack. And it's on its way. And it's good. So the drive ends, not with a touchdown, but with a field goal. And the coaches, while no doubt happy for the three, will have to take a look at how to push it down the field all the way the next time for a touchdown. The key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. And I'm sure they're thinking touchdown for their next one. Number 14 to kick off. Number 29. He sends it off. You need a field goal or a touchdown right here to respond to that score. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 23. Field. Far with the pass. So he can't come up. With it. I think he just took his eyes off that one. Right. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own twenty three. Set with only one back behind him. Can't bring him down. Duncan records the tackle at the 27. And that tackle gives him three in the game. Now it's third and six coming up. The Packers line up in the shotgun. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the St. Louis Rams ahead of the Green Bay Packers. 13, 7. The teams are set for the fourth quarter of play. Now it's third and six coming up. Drops back with the throw. Nice completion. He never hesitated on that play. This receiver can really do it all. He has speed, he runs great routes, and he can make catches on any kind of throw. But he's got those great hands. Right. First and ten. Right. Dropping back. Gets rid of it. Glenn was the intended receiver. Far fires the pass, but it's overthrown. He just threw that pass too hard. The receiver might have caught up with the ball if he used a little more time. Right. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 39. That Lining up with their big set this time. Green on the camera. He can't wrap him up. And he's brought down at the 47. You know what? You wear down the defense with this kind of running game. And maybe two. Over there, over there. Fifth play of this drive. Looking for an opening. The offensive line looked like they just collapsed on that play. The offensive line has to get good movement on the snap of the ball for the inside run to work, and it didn't happen on that play. Number nine is back to punt. Wilkins sets up, waiting for the punt. Wilkins will call for the fair catch. The offense ready to go again after their last drive ended with three points. Right. So they have first and ten here. Ball on their own 30. Field. Look 
looking for a receiver. Rolls right, throws it. He finds his man. And he stopped at the 17. Warner, that pass puts him over the 150-yard mark. First and ten. Ball on the ball. Stutter step. Couldn't find much of a hole, and he's brought down after a gain of what looks like a couple. Yeah, you talk about push. This line got no push at all, and there was nowhere to go. So it's first and goal. Ball one inch out. Right. Everybody up on the line. He's going to throw. Tosses it right. And it's caught. Kirk Warner has now thrown for two touchdowns. the tackle they get the two for two points as we take a look at his success returning kicks we get ready for the kickoff Wilkins looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off he kicks it off 29 is looking to pick up some blocking. Missed the tackle. Holding number 65. Receiving team. That's a 10 yard penalty. First down may be where they try something towards the end zone, since they'll have three more downs to work with after that. So they have first and 10 here. Ball on their own 17. Field. Pump. Andy Stump at the 10. Inside their own 20. The Packers line up at the shotgun. He's looking. He goes to the left side. The 40. The 50. The 40. The 30. The 20. The 10. Touchdown, Packers! And a great throw for the touchdown. Yeah, he threw that where only the receiver could get it. And 
bandage up. The point after is good. Longwell sets up for the onside kick. Number 82 and number 83. Here's the onside kick. The returner looking for room upfield. You know, they could put this one away with a good drive here. They've almost got this game won, but they still need to run it to make the defense use their timeout. They're just about in field goal range. Andy Stunt at the 42. A consistent running game will make the play action pass more effective. They've almost got this game won, but they still need to run it to make the defense use their timeout. Right. Nine yards to go. Four tucks it away. Nice spin move there. You don't need a flashy running game to win games. Sometimes all you need to do is control the clock and wear down that defense. Right. Third and two coming up here. Ball on the 36-yard line. With an extra DB, the defense is in the nickel. Troll. In motion. Ball looking for a seam. Sharper. He's starting to make his presence felt out there. He might have gotten a yard or two. That guy got knocked around by that defense. He needs a little protection from his lineman. So as the game winds down, we'll see the place kicker. Right. Wilkins looking to make a good kick here. The long field goal attempt is on its way. Wilkins didn't appear to get all of it, and the kick fell short. Right. Uh, that's a lined up in an eye. Quick drop, far. Let's it fly. Archuleta got his hand in there to knock it down. You know, he did what you thought to do. That's take away the ability for the receiver to catch the ball. He can't catch it when you knock it down. The defense right. can put this one to rest if they can make the play or two. They did pretty well on first down, so let's see if they can force a third down here. Back to pass. Flips it out there. Knocked down. Far. Could have had that one intercepted. Yeah, that guy trusts his arm. He thought he could rifle it in there. Right. It's third down, and they have a long way to go. Switch, switch. With an extra DB, the defense is in the next one. He's looking to pass. He's looking. Passes left. Driver was the intended receiver. The defense came up big on that incompletion. This is where you have to clamp down. Play tight, keep the pressure on. Fourth and long, they have to make something happen here, or this one is pretty much over. They might just go deep, hoping for a pass interference call. Fourth and ten. Ball on their own 41. Franks goes in motion. Back to pass. He's looking. He goes to the left side. Ferguson could make the catch. The offense turns the ball over on downs. When a team gambles and makes it, the coach is a hero. If they fail, everyone will second-guess the coach all week long. They don't need to run any type of play here. The quarterback could just go with a kneel down. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively. Just about in field goal range. Ball on the 43-yard line. Four linemen and three linebackers lined up defensively.
The defense is out of timeout. All the offense has to do is kneel down. The final score is St. Louis 21, Green Bay 14.